Splash! Hello, my name is Paige Conjure and this is the Tarpon Springs Aquarium Animal Spotlight. And today, we are going to be talking about one of my favorite fish, the Goliath Grouper. This is Oscar, and he lives here at the aquarium. He is just about a little over a hundred pounds, but he can get way bigger than that. Goliath grouper grow to be one of the biggest kinds of grouper in the whole world. They can get to be 800 pounds and eight feet long. That would be like the size of a smart car. Now, you're probably wondering, what would a giant fish like Oscar eat? Well, they eat just about anything smaller than them. Some Goliath grouper will eat mostly crabs, small sharks, barracuda, moray eels, all kinds of different fish, or even smaller groupers. But they're kind of like protectors of the reef. These are some Goliath grouper that I was lucky enough to see while I was diving on a shipwreck in the Gulf of Mexico. These guys will come right up to you and look at you. They're really curious, try to figure out what you are. I've never had any Goliath grouper show me any signs of aggression in the wild. Now look at this guy. I came across him hiding under a ledge, and when I got to him, he kind of just looked at me. Look at him kind of watch me and sort of size me up and make sure I am no threat to him whatsoever. He allowed me to get extremely close because he was curious about me, just like I was curious about him. Now, I don't recommend trying this in the wild. I have years of experience working with these animals and I'm aware of what they're capable of and the risks I was taking. I've been working with Goliath Grouper and uh, training them, feeding them by hand for, uh, what has been? Um, it's been about almost six years now. I am constantly impressed with how powerful and how intelligent they are. Oh, now watch this. As I start to pet Oscar, he actually opens up his mouth and gills and relaxes. And I can even give him a little kiss on the head or sometimes put my hand inside his mouth. Now that's because in the wild, hundreds of little cleaner fish would go inside his mouth and pick out any tiny little parasites he might have growing in there. And to him, my fingers feel the same. Goliath groupers are extremely gentle and beautiful animals and they deserve and demand our respect and our protection. They get so big, they are so cool, and they are absolutely a fish that we want to have around for generations to come. But to do that, we need to be really careful. It's illegal to catch or spear Goliath grouper at all, but we need to make sure that we protect our ocean habitats so that Goliath grouper can continue to survive and thrive in the future. Have a fantastic day, and thank you so much for watching. Thank <laughs> you.